What is going on, Insomniacs? Midnight Sound 518 here. We are back with episode 46 of Horizon Zero Dawn, where we left off. A little bit of a cliffhanger. I'm going to keep playing. Um, but you guys were here last week. Anyways, I'm going to hit the back button. We're going to continue on with where we are on the story mission after we got kicked in the face. <laughs> here we go. Ah, yes, I'm in a cage. Who would have got her? Who would have guessed? My entire life. I've always known one thing with prophetic certainty. That I was destined for glory as a great champion of the sun. Where are my weapons? Even when Jaron was murdered. Even when Meridian fell. Where the hell I am I? Doubted my destiny. Did you steal my stuff, bro? That was expensive. Came along. When I heard that you had survived, a doubt took root in my mind. As sure as the sun rises and falls each day, those I am bade to kill die. And oh, you? you? How? Why? I hate this guy. With each dig site you attacked, each loyal soldier you killed, this pestering doubt grew. I kept thinking of the moment my knife pierced your throat. One twist, a simple tug of the blade, and you would have bled out. In slaughter, I am a practiced hand. So why hesitate? Why fail my destined purpose? Hmm. I want to be passive aggressive. If you're going to go on babbling like this all night, could you just kill me now? Oh no. We're in no hurry, you and I. Not now. Maybe some physical torture to distract me from your voice? At that moment <laughs> on the mountain, I aimed to kill you with dispatch, and yet did not. Why? This failing troubled my thoughts. Yeah. It haunted every step. It was only when I captured you down in that place that I finally glimpsed the sun's design etched at length across the course of events. You sound really creepy right now, bro. You were meant to survive that day on the mountain. Meant to interfere at dig sites and kill my men. Conversely, I was meant to capture you. Ah, oh, you're one of these guys. Here. Fanatic. So that you might die as a sacrificial offering to the sun. Uh-huh. Everything as it was meant to be. Predestined and preordained. Yep, you brought me here so I can murder your face. You're an idiot. A dangerous idiot. But an idiot. All this talk of destiny and fate. I'm sure Hades speaks the same language, doesn't he? You're being played for a fool. Hades is an ancient machine, not the buried shadow of Karja myth. It doesn't care about Meridian. It wants to kill everything and everyone. And you are its dutiful slave. I serve not the buried shadow, but the sun in shadow. All halves of nature join to one cause. Shadow to sun, dark. To light. You're gonna doom the human race, my guy. How ridiculous that sounds. You've gone from serving an insane homicidal sun king to an insane homicidal machine. You're moving down in the world, not up. I'll remember those words as I watch your corpse burn. Whatever's left of it. You fail to grasp the point. As surely as you've been conquered, so has all doubt. And with certainty of belief comes uns. 
unstoppable force. Mm. Cage and put your faith to the test. See if things work out like you expect. The circle has closed. Every element is in its proper place, exactly where it belongs. I want to know where he got bullets the beast from. Now caged will serve her true purpose. A sacrificial animal. Oh, speaking of sacrifice, I forgot to tell you. After you crashed the Eclipse Network, I sent messengers into the East to rally the forces there and mount an invasion of the sacred land. I ordered every Nora killed. I was hoping to catch you there, but alas, it all seems to have been unnecessary. Mm. The Nora have no part to play in this. Leave them alone. Soon, they'll have no part to play in anything. That much is sure. In any case, I couldn't recall the order even if I wished to. Thanks to your destruction of the network, communication play this on me. is impossible. You not only doomed yourself, but an entire tribe. Nah, they can hold their own. Do we not see the scorching judgment of the sun in these events? Nope, you're just insane. Your focus. Such a powerful device, isn't it? And yet, so fragile. Oh, great. So you see, this time, I did not hesitate. The knife has already been twisted. Oh boy. Here we go. Can I please just fucking hijack a Thunderjaw and end all of this bullshit? The false Sun King will be dead, and Holy Meridian ours once more. Nah, I think I'm gonna sink this city to the bottom of the ocean. Have become an instrument of prophecy. All halves of nature join to one cause: shadow to sun, light to dark, night to day. Behold! <laughs> Notice how they all just immediately freak out. Oh my god. Hold your seats! Can you not see the proof of the sun's blessing before your eyes? Yeah, no, you just hijacked them and they're on your fucking side, you piece of shit. Proud broad light of day. Were they not approved by the sun and joined to our cause? Many years ago, to consecrate this great ring, the Radiant Turan ordered many faithless, crushed beneath the hooves of the behemoth. Mighty is the behemoth in the eye of the sun, but it is mightier still, infused with the power of shadow. Let great. this one, who schemed and slithered, be the first to die. Let her be the first of thousands great genocide it is Oh, fuck me. I wasn't built to take a behemoth to repeater. 
Fuck me. I should try luring the behemoth into the pillars. That did it. One more pillar on that platform will come down. And my weapon's finished. He's charging. Fuck me! I can't get out of the way of this stupid thing! Ah! I can't see! Come at me, stupid! Quick costume change. Ah, don't you boo me, I'll shoot arrows into the crowd. Hey! Guess who got a weapons back? Now you're just a big dumb target. Come and get it! Those components on the sides of its head. Oh, fuck me! the hell? How do you just turn mid-fucking-run? Stupid piece of dump. Fuck you. Come here, bitch. The fact that it could just change direction mid-sprint was incredibly unfair. <laughs> That's not how a charge works. Oh, yay. Great. Well, hopefully some corruption works on them. Kill her. Why leave it to them? Come get me yourself. Huh? What that? Who that? I could have taken him. Don't mess up my moment. Oh. So you're not an AI. Oh boy.
Yes! Yes! Alright, that was a pretty badass escape. If I don't say so myself. Shit. <laughs> so you're here. Oh my god. You're really here. You risked your life. Of course I did. If you'd been killed, the Nora Sacred Mountain would never have given up its secrets. Too bad you wasted your time, then. Helis destroyed my focus. And the Alpha Registry with it. Not at all. The whole time I've been monitoring your focus, I duplicated every data file you scanned. Of course you did! Installing that data to a new focus was trivially easy. Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. You're hmm. really good at making it impossible to like you, Silence. But I'm like this. It's time to see where you were born. Maybe you'll even learn why. Yeah. Meet the machine that birthed me into this world. Isn't that how you put it? I'll be off. Wait. Yes? How did you track my location when I, I guess wasn't I wearing a focus? I guess I could just listen all these. Really it doesn't take a genius to surmise that Helis would throw you into the sun when we get high noon. I wore out two striders getting here in time. Now be on your way. Since when can you override machines? Ever since you discovered the technique. I had to destroy a corrupter to obtain the necessary parts, of course. But your example showed me how to do that as well. Yet another benefit of monitoring your activities through your focus. Truth be told, the underlying logic of the technique isn't right. so different from rites practiced by Banuk shamans. Though, of course, far more. Great. You're welcome, I guess. Helis recognized you back in the Sun Ring. You told me that you'd assisted the Eclipse. Not that you knew the man who killed my... Who almost killed me. So now you know. The man is a serious threat. So let's do all we can to make sure that he and Hades don't succeed. Right. I'll be on my way. To make matters worse, Helis ordered an Eclipse detachment to attack the Nora Sacred Land. The tribe's already weak. They won't stand a chance. You should come with me. Oh, absolutely not. I have preparations to make elsewhere. What kind of... Why do I bother asking? I want to know what the neon is that's flowing through your damn right, skin. I'll be in touch. I'll contact you later. In the meantime, should you need to return to Shadow Karja territory, I brought armor to conceal your identity. You think of everything, don't you? One of us has to. Aloy, when you were recovering the Alpha Registry down in the Zero Dawn bunker, I was needlessly cruel. For your sake, I hope there is someone waiting there for you inside the mountain. Not a what, but a who. Yeah. The first time in this game that they actually had somebody ride away from you at the end of a damn cutscene. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my gosh. Okay, well, that was interesting. Huh? Who the hell that? Interesting. Heart of the Nora. Yep, that is the very last mission, I think. One of the last ones, but it's the uh, the mission that gets me the la or the entrance into the mountain, which will get me the last what you call it uh, power cell, so I can go get the power armor, which will be awesome, and uh, I am very excited to have it. I guess we're going to go knock out this side quest that I randomly have. 
Oh, never mind. It's the, the, the chick from earlier that told me to meet her downstairs, and then I didn't listen to it. So. Oh, sick. Oh, no, that's what I'm wearing. Ah! Ugh. I hate this. I hate this so much. I guess I should probably throw something on that, huh? Anything that gives me anything good. Resistance to ranged attacks. Screw it. Stealth, I guess. I don't I don't really <laughs> not a whole lot else I can throw on that. Well this armor sounds very heavy. Do a quick save. The food is from Dowager Queen Nasadi, little ones. Her Highness knows times are hard and helps when she can. Eat. Bring some home for your families, if you have one. I've heard whispers about you. Rides machines, fancy spear, delightful freckles. Some even say you have a conscience. <laughs> How extraordinary. Who are you? You're obviously not one of the Shadow Karja. My name is Vanasha. For now, all you need to know is that I'm a whisper of reason in this howling pit of insanity. Why? <laughs> I know how that feels. I'm sure you do. And so does Dumbasses. He's a good man, so naturally the Shadow Karja want to murder him. I've done some digging, and I think he's headed for the green climb. It won't take those mercenaries long to find him. He could use some help, if you're so inclined. Stop being evasive and tell me who you really are. Stop I hate this evasive? face mask. You might as well tell me to stop being charming. It's impossible, but I like you, so I'll tell you a secret. I have friends in Meridian, and I like to do favors for them when I can. Uthid might be of use to them, if he survives. How do you know Uthid is innocent? I'm excellent at making inquiries. Look, he feeds orphans from his own rations and personally punishes anyone who hurts the old or infirm. The idea that he would try to kill Edaman is ridiculous. He must have found something that can embarrass the priesthood. Otherwise, Bahavas wouldn't risk marking such a well-regarded man for death. I still don't know who Uthid is. Is that the, the dude that the kid empowered him? What makes him Whatever the hell. He knows he'll be pursued, so he needs a hideout fake that's king. familiar and defensible. He once single-handedly held off an entire bandit clan in those foothills. My guess is that he'll fall back on what worked before. I'll do what I can for Uthid, but what about you? What about me what? What will you do while I risk my life? Useful things, little huntress. Look for three dead trees south of Sunfall. They mark the start of the green climb. Good luck. Everything about that conversation was delayed between the sound and the uh, other thing. 700? I am definitely not walking that far. Son of a bitch, I don't have any of these stupid campsites. Well, maybe I will walk, and then I can discover these campsites along the way. <laughs> ah, it's so unfortunate. This is why I like to discover as many campsites as I can. Because the more campsites I discover, the more easier my life is. Not a big fan that I can hear footsteps over there. 
Well, guess we're going up the side of a mountain now. The truck's up here. Time yeah, because they went up. Yeet! I missed. Ow, ow, oh, you got to be kidding me. Is that not the way I was supposed to go? It most definitely looks like the way I'm supposed to go. Well, I was just jumping short. That's cool. go and up okay I can't stand this armor much better Whoop. you go, Uthid. Food scraps. I'll bet Uthid stopped. He must have kept going. I've got to catch up. Just running along the ridge line in the middle of a snowstorm. Well, I guess not really, just snow on the ground. That's cool looking. A dead machine. Uthid's been hunting. Don't mind if I yes. Everything useful has been stripped. Uthid's been gathering components. Probably for him. Great. Phone talks. I can discourage. Great. Oh, of course I have to kill the gun hops, but why the freak wouldn't I? Really hoping I can just avoid having to hang out with the Glint Hawks. Okay, so I'm going up this way. Oh no, I'm going the other. Hey, cat. Luther took down a Ravager. Not an easy kill, but worth it for the parts. I will take down. I take all of your all of your parts. Question is, what are all these creatures doing all the way up here? Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> I thought I was gonna die. Uh. Hello. The next one doesn't miss. Uthid. You're young for a bounty hunter. Not a bounty hunter. Am I hunter. old for a soldier? I'm not here for the price on your head, Uthid. I believe you're innocent. Innocent? <laughs> Come on, then. If this is a trick, 
It's a good one. You've earned your kill. Sure about that? Don't mind me. I'm just gonna raid your camp real quick. Can't carry more. Thanks, Betty. No tricks. Just talk. All right. Speak. I want to know what happened at Sunfall. What really happened. All right. For weeks, each dawn in the tent city came with a new death. <laughs> Always in their sleep, no struggle. The old, the infirm, sometimes the young. Those who couldn't fight for the cause. I should have realized then it was a culling. Who would do such a thing? They thought it was a curse, an evil spirit. But it was only a man. And a silent poison. It took time to catch him, but we did. We brought him before Bahavis for the sun's judgment. The high priest Bahavis? He's the one who put the bounty on you. Yes. He thanked me for my diligence, then had his guards release the villain. Mm. You see? It was he who ordered the culling. Then they turned on us. Should have died with my men, so their loyalty meant something. Twenty years I gave to the sun. For what? Malice and murder? As for honor? Sacrifice? True sacrifice? The kind priests and rulers know nothing of? It's all a fat joke. If it's honor you seek, the sun car just seem trustworthy. A little stuck up, maybe, but trustworthy. Those cards at once raided your Nora lands. Raided every land we could reach. It was the sun's will. So I did what I was told. Others did worse. But as their captain, I had... Uthid, I don't care what you did. I, I can't absolve you. But the Karja are changing their ways. You could too. Perhaps. Avad doesn't understand what the sun demands of its soldiers. Perhaps he understands it too well. Now you sound like the blameless Murad. I can believe you're a good man. But why go with the Shadow Karja in the first place? Why serve them? Because of Itaman, of course. He was the one true Sun King. Itaman's just a child. Yes, an untainted vessel. I believed he was pure. But they used him, used our faith. I can see that now. No shadows under a noonday sun. The Havas didn't need to disgrace my name. I did it myself, serving a rotten throne. I met someone who wants to get you out of this. A woman named Vanasha. But first, we need to get you out of here. What are you? You look like a hunter. You give orders like a soldier who's been out... Mercenaries. What? Think they'll all line up to tell me I'm innocent? Should have stayed on the plains, Kaja! The mountains belong to us! Key Cook's killers! What the hell? When we're done with you, you won't even leave an echo! You didn't make it hard to be followed. Almost as if you wanted to go out in a showdown. Not much gets by you. Help me, fools! Great. Adam. Rally, we can still finish them.
Bird. That won't be the last. Got him. Follow me. I've stashed supplies up above. Following. Oh. Okay. I'll push you up and you'll leave me to die. Up and over. Or you won't. Sick. Grab what you can while we still have time. Oh man, we are out of time. You again? A robust defense is the most satisfying to break. All right, Marbles. We brought the priest out here, so let's put on a show for him. Oh, great. Of I course. know that, Hood. We've unfinished business, Bahavas and I. This will be difficult. I think you rallied to a lost cause. I don't intend to die today, Uthid. I did. But you're starting to change my mind. Oh, I hope so. The last of the marbles. Son of a Hobbit bitch. Body had enough fodder to keep him safe. Now there's hope for justice. Will you come with me? Maybe. How many more times am I going to get shot today? This won't be easy. Bahava still has his personal guard. Why do you wear your sleeves like that? <laughs> it's a 
serious question. I think I should probably. Man, this episode is running so long. Let's see if we can't take this dude out. And then we'll call it an episode. End your suffering, I'm gonna shoot you in the face. And mine. The Outlanders led us here, and now that they are dead, their price is most affordable. But enough with needles. It's time for blades. Remove them from the sun's sight. Okay. Three. That was awkward. After. Scalp the savage. Stay on the move. Shit. The sun sets on your pathetic life, Uthid. Make it hurt as the shadow falls Don't upon Don't let them. him team up! Traitor! Kill a Nora! Don't make me do all the work! All right, get out of the way, bitch! Kill a traitor! Kill a Nora! Yep. The ledge. That really wasn't that bad of a fight. Here we go. Thanks, buddy. Whatever deal you worked out with him, I'll double it. More than double it. No. I'm tired of this, Bahavas. The lies and the violence and your cheap scented oils. I don't suppose you'd kill yourself. He's got a knife. I had to. I had to. Prune the weak, or all the Karja and Shadow are doomed. This solves nothing. But may the sun find some worth among your drying bones. Ah! The other guy has a knife. Good for you. I wasn't a fan of your hat. That was quite a fireworks show. You oh, took hello. your time? I was busy. What do you think happened to Yan Shand, the other mercenary band? And I had to organize passage to Meridian for a wanted man. Give us a moment, Uthid. Girl talk. Uh -huh. You've had quite a day. I never imagined Bahavas would blunder into his own trap. His death opens up wonderful possibilities. Remember Edaman and Nasadi? The Child King and his mother guarded like hostages at Sunfall? With Bahavas gone, no one will be watching them. I want to get them out. And I could use your help. Ah, uh, we're going to jump straight to the point. Nasadi and Edaman out of Sunfall. With Bahavas dead, Sunfall is the easy part. I'll handle that. The big fuss will be crossing Rumba. the border to the Sundom. Find my friend, Three Tohuadid, near the branded shore. I hired his crew to sweep the path, so all you have to do is wait for me. If this Wadiv has already cleared the area, why do you need me? Contingencies, little huntress. Something will go wrong, and I need protection I can count on. You. I'll try not to disappoint. Well, that was, uh... The Nora said you would help me. Quite interesting. Are we bound for Meridian? 
Can I go down that? Go, my dear. What choice do I have? None at all. I was just being polite. Wow. Alrighty, guys. Well, uh, that just about wraps up today's episode. It is much longer than it should have been, but that's okay. Hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, please drop a like and a subscribe. Come back next week for another one. And I will see you guys then, I guess. I mean, that's on out.